Good morning, folks. This is Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny, but with a lot of Saharan dust, Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 11 a.m. update, uh, 11 a.m. update. And currently we have all the U.S. equity uh, that we track trading the downside. Dow's off 55 points. That's less than two tenths of a percent. Four tenths for the S&P, 18 points there. A little over one percent for the NDX 100, 160 points. Russell's off 24, one and a quarter percent, four percent to the downside for the semis. They're trading out at 2883. You've got gold trading out at 1806. That's up two bucks. Silver's off uh, 20 cents, trading at 2040. Lights recruit up 80 pennies, 9155 is the print there. National gas up 27 cents, 785. And the 30 year treasury is flat at 142.16. So, what's all that mean? Well, if we go take a look at our nine panel market update chart, we'll begin by taking a look at the ES mini in the upper left hand side. What you will see is a new profile that is attempting to form. That new profile says that we should have support at 41.91 and a quarter. The uh, spot volatilities is still below its 50-day exponential moving average. That's typically bullish for the S&P 500. But yesterday was a TD9 count top. And that suggests that we should see price pull back to that 41, 40.91 level. If we take a look at the NQ, the NQ generated a buy, a sell the D point pattern. It did it on uh, Friday when it generated that bearish engulfing candle. We're getting a little bit of follow through now. What price is doing right now is testing the top of its weekly profile, 13.004. We're trading out right now at 13.006. So that is a level of support. We'll take a look at that, try to figure out what might be going on in an interday time period chart. Um, when we go do the uh, Trader Z show. If we take a look at the U.S. dollar index, it's just consolidating with inside its daily profile. The support range there is at the 105.63 level, and 106.82 is resistance. Gold is trading above resistance. Resistance was the top of its profile. Looks like this could be day number two above that level, 1797. If we get that, that suggests that price should run back to its recent highs in the 18, uh, 1900 area. If we take a look at silver, it does have an A to B equals CD to the upside pattern, but price really needs to stay above the top of its daily profile. That's at 2051. If it does, that suggests move to 2197, maybe 2265. Lights Week Crude still has its currently buy pattern. That remains in effect as long as price closes above 88 and a quarter. Price is trading with inside a new daily profile. Price should target its descending trend line. That's up in the 90. 590, 95, 93, 96 type area. Natural gas having a nice day, but just consolidated with inside its bullish structure daily profile. Resistance here is eight dollars and twenty cents, and another consolidation between support and resistance from a daily time frame is the thirty-year Treasury support one forty thirty-one resistance one forty-four oh nine. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Z Show. But if you're off to start your Tuesday, have a terrific one, and we'll look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care now. <laughs>